Food, fun, and live performances mark the first annual Jack Daniels Tennessee Honey Neighborhood Flavor Community Cookout, also meant to celebrate the recent opening of Ampanology Restaurant right here at 2407 Third Avenue. From the food vendors to the barbers, uh, to, to just the local artisans. After we kind of told them about what it was that we were trying to accomplish, uh, everybody was really excited to be a part of it. I'm having a great time. Yes, it's my mom right there. Also in the spotlight, local talent. Here's professional drummer and Bronx native Anthony Anderson, who says his first lessons were from his dad, who also was a drummer. I continue to just live it. Live it, breathe it, sleep it, and just become it. And really just do it for the community. Involve myself within everything, what everyone is doing, but really give back. It's a full pork, Jack Daniels, with barbecue sauce and mac and cheese. Also giving back founder and chef of Ampanology, Jason Alise and co-owner Ruby Alise to say they are making waves by providing empanadas like you've never tasted before. We have 45 flavors on the menu and that our menu changes every two weeks. We cater to everyone, friends, family, adults, young children. They've joined a bevy of other businesses flocking the area like Beatstro and Mott Haven Bar and Grill. We're proud to be their neighbors and be part of this amazing community. Coming from the neighborhood is tremendous. I mean, to see the progression, to see, you know, the gentrification happening in the area, not to mention, you know, people from the Bronx, you know, opening up businesses. I mean, it's it's inspiring. It's tremendous. Paying homage to hip hop, Eddie Santos, the general manager of Beatstro, is joined here by his chef, Leonardo Marino, to talk about the cuisine. Hip hop dining. That's right. So we're, we have a good time with it, and we're, we're just, that's what we want to do. Super happy uh, Jack Daniels is here in the South Bronx. From food to South Bronx products, Omoris Grian is founder of Bronx Native Gear. You can see more on BronxNative.com. More than the opening of Ampanology, this is a celebration of Bronx culture, and at this party, everyone's invited. For Bronx Native, this is Arlene McCoco.